A lot of women these days are part of the sandwich generation, meaning they're taking care of both their kids and their aging parents at the same time. The term aging in place refers to those older adults who, if they have an ailment, want to be taken care of at home rather than reside at a long-term care facility or have to recover short-term at a hospital. So how do these women balance aging in place with caregiving? Here this morning to educate us about practical solutions that can help you smooth out the process is Kim Dennis, Group Vice President of the Post-Acute Group for Hill Rom Company. Welcome, Kim. Good morning. Good morning. Give us an idea, first off, what the numbers are like, because I think they're pretty staggering. How many people here in the U.S. are affected by this? Well, there are millions and millions of people. Uh, there's a new, you know, there's really a new thought process here of, that people have about aging in place. In fact, 90% of those over 65 prefer to reside in their home as they uh, continue to deal with uh, increasing health conditions. What that means is that there are nearly 22 million homes uh, who are dealing with an aging parent or a loved one in their home. and. The majority of those homes require some level of care, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, uh, so that there are almost 52 million people providing care to those loved ones. Half of those people are women at, who have full-time jobs and in addition to caring for their loved ones. You know, this can create a tremendous strain on a family and uh, helping the family work through the things that they need, the medical devices that they need, the medicines, uh, all of the financial situations, those types of things are the things we help a family navigate the road on. And and I imagine it's great help that you're giving. I know that with my grandmother years ago, and she's passed since, but when she first became ill, fractured her hip, she was not the same after that. She lost her independence. And my mother really struggled with having to place her in a home. She would have loved to have taken care of her, but she feared she couldn't physically do it. How does Hill Rom help families going through that? Well, our, we have a process where we will work with the patient and the family and the care team to identify exactly what a patient's health care situation is so that we understand the bed frame that's required. They may require a standard bed frame or a hydraulic bed frame that moves up and down. They may require a bariatric bed frame. We'll also discern what type of surface they need to be cared for on. Um, it will depend on their mobility and those types of things so that we can decide exactly the right surface to deliver the therapy that they need. Kim, obviously you're helping the patients, but what do you do to help the caregivers, whether it's family members or visiting nurses? Well, it's important that you do help both of them. Uh, for caregivers, one of the most uh, serious things that happens to a caregiver while providing care is back injuries. Many of our products have been uh, developed over 80 years, over the last 80 years, and working with caregivers to understand exactly the types of injuries they, they incur. So some of our products can move up and down on a hydraulic lift so the care can be delivered at an optimal height. One of the other things that's important for caregivers is to have patient independence. And so many of the pendants and the things that a patient uses to operate the bed frame have been designed with that in mind to maintain their independence and to be uh, providing the continuity of care. So many of those patients have come from an acute care setting, a hospital setting, and they will see the exact same kinds of controls that they saw in the hospital, which really helps them make that transition much easier. Definitely. And when it comes to the cost, does insurance cover this at all? In some cases, insurance will cover this. In rental situations, um, sometimes Medicare will cover that. We work with the patient and the family to understand exactly the health care situation that they're dealing with, to understand exactly what product is required, and then discern whether or not that product qualifies for reimbursement. If not, they have the option to purchase those products, and then we will work with them to provide the best possible care at the most economical cost for the family. Hillrom also goes the extra mile and helps patients and caregivers once the product's at home. How so? We have a 24 by 7 uh, customer service that has that feeds orders and information into over 185 service centers across the, the U.S. Those service centers are staffed by 1,300 trained technicians who know exactly what to do when they deliver product into a home. They'll know how to work with the family to have that set up and how to train the family, both the, the patient and the caregiver, on exactly how those products need to work. And then if questions come up after the fact, we have a 7 by 24 call center that's available to help as well. 80 years experience, that's a long time. Thank you so much, Kim, for being with Thank us you. here today. And if you want more information on Hill Rom beds, mattresses, and the equipment they offer, go to our website at thebalancingact.com slash hill dash rom. Want more of your favorite morning show? You'll find it at thebalancingact.com. Log on and find it all.